Alan Drakis, who was on CBC's Ascension. He's in The Fixer, which is coming up. And he's also in Danny Malin's newest film, Sweet As, which we just finished shooting. Woohoo! It's a wrap! Yeah! So, what was the best part about working with Danny? Uh, first, he got just the greatest team together to, to work on this movie, and uh, so Aww. that was just, it was phenomenal. Just working with a great uh, group of people, and that got me, because I can be pretty silly on set, so everybody, yeah. <laughs> everybody pretty A much, little silly. A little, little silly. So, uh, and, and you play Dean. I play Dean. So, tell me, like, the thing about Dean to me is that he has some funny moments, but also some very serious, dark moments. So, t talk to me a bit about the character and how you balance those things. I think he's just stuck in a moment that, you know, sometimes something bad happens to you in life mm -hmm. and you have a hard time getting over that. And I think that's uh, the heart of Dean in a way. Mm -hmm. He has a hard time getting over certain things in his life mm -hmm. that weigh him down. Uh, he takes that out with uh, drinking. Mm -hmm. uh, and he doesn't pretty much connect with a lot of people. Mm -hmm. So that was something I could relate to. The funny side is uh, him when he's laid back through the booze. Yes. Uh, it just in, uh, it just relaxes him and opens him up, and he could be uh, he could be a little silly. Totally, and um, not to get too dark here, but uh, the theme of depression mm -hmm. and you know honoring a character who's going through depression because it's a very real thing. Yeah, it's a very common thing. Um, so, what was your process like there? Well. Uh, you know, I know quite a few people that have had depression, mm -hmm. so I could definitely tap into uh, the conversations I've had with them, mm -hmm. uh, and that I could use in the character of Dean. But it is hard. It is hard because these are people that dwell on certain events that's happened to them in their lives, and it's mm -hmm. very, very hard to get over uh, mm -hmm. that, you know? So uh, I feel uh, when Dean would focus on the life he chose for himself, the love that he doesn't have, uh, his children, all that helped him uh, encompass pretty much who he is. Absolutely. And uh, tell me a little bit about your upcoming projects, because yeah. I know you have some exciting things coming up. Well, I have a, a TV a series called Echelon that should be, we start shooting soon, I think in a month, and uh, pretty much follows uh, a fashion designer, Ian Marlowe, the character I play, and uh, there's this company out there that hires him and they tell him we could make all your dreams come true. Uh, so they give him the money, they bring him to fame, but they ask for one favor in return, which happens to be his sister Oh. Uh, that he grew up with. Do you have a sister? Yes. Oh my uh, God. I have two sisters actually. I grew up with two sisters. Would you give them away? Uh, no. That'd be, hard. <laughs> That'd be hard. We give you a million dollars, but you got to give up your sister one day. No, so there's, wow. there's this... Uh, there's like a lot of drama going on to who these guys are. They gave me the money and they kidnapped my sister and I have to find her and so that's pretty exciting. Very cool. We're shooting in Prague right now so what? good luck. Do you get to go to Prague? Uh, we don't, I don't get to go to Prague. Uh, hopefully. Maybe but you, but you live through. in Montreal so They're going to make the old port awesome. of Montreal look like, you can make it look like any ancient city. In the, Absolutely, in the it's beautiful. And then I have the fixer coming out soon. Uh, I play a character, Weber. This is a team of Navy SEALs who uh, create uh, certain um, world catastrophes that affect the stock market. Okay. So I play one of the bad guys. And uh, Do you yeah. think that that's realistic, that people do make catastrophes I, to affect the stock market? I have to say, it's super interesting. <laughs> Reading the script, I'm like, oof, wow. Conspiracy. There's a lot of, it could be, I think. I don't know. I don't know enough about it, but it's interesting. I think I think it could be happening, but I don't mm -hmm. like to think yeah, about that. Totally. It make me bitter. Yes. And where is the best place for us to follow you and keep up with all these great projects you're doing? Online? Sure. So I'm not the best with social media. Uh, so my girlfriend, she's like fiance. Fiance. Eesh, fiance. <laughs> uh, so I have my Facebook page, uh, Spiromon Dracus on Facebook. I have my Twitter account. And I should be launching a, a web page soon, SpiromonDracus.com, uh, in the next couple months. So great. all my updates will be posted. Well, thank you so much, and it was great working with you, even though, you know, we had our moments of tension. <laughs> <laughs> but congrats on all of your upcoming High five, stuff. you're awesome. Oh, you're awesome. A blast. Thank you. I'm Katie Allman, reporting for Katie Chat in Montreal.
much for watching Baby Chats. If you like the show, please subscribe. And if you're curious to know what I'm doing when I'm not interviewing, please click here. I'm also an actress and recently produced my first short film and would love for you to check out the trailer. Thank you.